Second Conference of the International Woman Suffrage Alliance was held in Berlin, Germany in June 1904. The main features of the Second Conference were the formation of the International Woman Suffrage Alliance and the adoption of the Declaration of Principles. At the Berlin meeting, seven national women suffrage associations were represented by regularly appointed delegates Denmark, Germany, GT. Britain, Norway, Sweden, the Netherlands, and the United States. Visitors from Switzerland, New Zealand, Austria, and Hungary were made members of the convention and were permitted to join freely in the discussion until the constitution should be adopted. When this had taken place, a role of the nations represented was called, and the delegates from Germany, Great Britain, Sweden, the Netherlands and the United States pledged affiliation with the new organisation, now called the International Woman Suffrage Alliance. The name of Australia was also added to the list as the Secretary reported the desire of the suffragists there to enter the new organisation as soon as it should be formed. The delegates from Norway explained that while they did not doubt that the Norwegian Suffrage Association would wish to become a member of the alliance, they did not feel authorised to pledge its affiliation until a conference could be had with the other members of their association. Some of the delegates from Denmark urged the impropriety of joining the alliance since the Danish Woman Suffrage Society had only worked for municipal suffrage. The election of officers, which followed was therefore participated in by delegates from five countries only. Four of these were represented on the official board. That Sweden was not so represented must have been because her delegates proposed no candidate. Soon after the adjournment of the alliance, some belated delegates from Norway arrived, and the expected conference took place. The report was at once made to the officers of the alliance, that the Norwegian Suffrage Association wished to become a member. The majority of the delegates from Denmark having conferred together, they likewise expressed a desire to enter the alliance, and pledged themselves that their association would declare itself for full suffrage. These two applications were presented to the officers yet remaining in Berlin, and the majority having voted to accept them, these two associations became members. Thus before leaving Berlin, every suffrage association in the world which could in any sense be called national except perhaps that of Canada, had entered into the alliance, and the number of countries represented was eight. See also International Alliance of Women <laughs>